I woke up this morning realizing that we had unfinished business. I realize that our professional relationship has been strained in various ways over the years. Mostly, the simple fact that I'm a mercenary and I take the jobs as they come. You pay me, I do your bidding. You don't pay me, I do someone else's bidding. However, three days ago, And they were carrying a coin. I'm sure you recognize it. I am willing to look past this transgression. For coin. However, if not, and all the assassins you want. Everyone will fail before my sword. Now, this is an empty threat. What information does Giovanni Sozon have? Oh. certain irritations to get out. And the fact that uh, Giovanni Sozono quietly took care of those irritations for you. And mainly several of your handmaidens buying for the throne. King, we uh, would not want the fact to get out that you have an axe fetish, and uh, several of your queen's heads have uh, rolled. We wouldn't want that information to get to your queen that. Um, Giovanni Salzono wielding that axe for you. And uh, if it was not for the queen with a certain knight that jousts up there, her head would have rolled last month. Lord Mayor. It is well documented that you are a man of ambition, desire, accomplishment. However, we would not want it to get out. That uh, you want the throne for yourself. As you feel as Lord Mayor, that you are the one in charge of the festival. That you are the one that wields the true power. That you are the one that requires people to bow to you. And that they only bow to the king because you tell them to. We would not want that information to get out that uh, two months ago, ordered me with a handsome coin to dispose of the king. If it were not for circumstances of 
people that uh, you had me to get dis- get disposed of first before your plot was known. However, I'm sure that such information, that such desires of yours to replace the king and make you king are not far removed from your memory. Your Majesties, Lord Mayor, I am willing to look past this convenient information and look past your transgressions against my honor trying to kill me. If you pay me, I will be quiet. However, if you betray my trust, if you send any more assassins after me, there will be no darkness, no shadows where that information can hide, where it will not come to the light of day. And one more thing. Next time you try to kill me, don't send Englishmen. At least send an Italian. They'll have a fighting chance. Good day.